G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel, welcome back for some more PGA Tour 2K21 and wherever you are, I thank you for watching. So today we have Jericho Falls Golf Club. This is designed by Fringe Element, aka Jake Perry. Alright, let's get into the settings. Uh, what do we got? Winds are default, fairways are normal, greens are normal, green speed is fast, the time of day is noon and the weather is overcast. And we will be playing from the black tees, measuring 7,132 yards on pin set one. All right, let's get into it. But before I do, if you're not a supporter of the channel and you would like to, by all means, you can smash that subscribe, smash that thumbs up, hit the little bell, because you will be notified next time a course comes out. And I can t guarantee you'll see some pretty hot courses from some pretty good designers here. Yeah, good place to check out courses. Anyway, with all that out of the way, let's get into it. Okay, here we are, out on the course. Wow, what a beautiful looking opening tee shot that is. Straight down the middle, you can see the bunkers left and right. Absolutely beautiful, but let's pull the camera back. Let's go up and now let's go and have a little bit of a look around this course, because um, looks like there's quite a lot to look at. I did jump in quickly and I was like, yeah, no, nah, we're doing it. Why not? And a beautiful um, big clubhouse down the back here, or behind us, I should say, not down the back. Wow, there's um some buildings have gone in to make that, and it's got two pools, one at either end. You got this beautiful decking out the side. Imagine just sort of sitting out there, just watching people smack the balls down the fairway. Yeah, very nice. So let's um let's go for a, fly, a uh, bit of a fly. I think we'll just go down off this first tee. Now there's these cart paths that sort of go everywhere around the course, but they are really cool. I like the way the designer's done them. They just uh, sort of wind in and out through the trees. I'll take you on one of them in a little bit, but yeah, he's done a very nice job on this course. Now there are a few versions of this. This is Jericho Falls Golf Club. There is GC and Jericho Falls, but he, I think he had a bit of a issue with lag. I can understand why there are quite a lot of trees, man. Like, quite a lot of trees. He probably cut back on a few of them, to be honest, but still very nice. That's just my opinion as well. Very nice. Oh, nice little stair work here. Going up to, or going down to that tea set. Let's um, sort of cruise on over this way. We've got a nice big waterfall over here. I want to check out this little area and show you a bit of the cart path that you'd sort of, you wouldn't see. Yeah, you got this nice green here, nice backdrop of the waterfall. It's done an absolute smashing job on it. The rock work is, again, very nice. But if we can just, let's just go for a little bit of a wander. Just through here. Just turn up, we'll just follow around. Just look where this pops out. You'd never see this. It's got this nice little bridge work up here. Look at that. Beautiful view as well. Let's pan the camera around. Nice shot down there. What's that? Maybe a par three, maybe? Down off into the distance there. Um, so what do we got? Let's, um, okay, let's, let's cruise through this way. Yeah, but see, look, again, there's the bridge and that car path all the way. Wind and beside the course. You've got the stairs coming down. It always, there's always a way to get down onto the course as well from the car path, which is pretty cool. There's another point there for the uh, the old cart. Yeah, but, oh wow, what a nice job of this course. There is quite a fa fair bit going on. A nice little tee box there. Ooh, coming around the corner, we have a split fairway. Oh yeah, giving us the choice of left and right there. Very nice. Uh, let's just go ahead and wander down through here. What do we got? Okay, okay. Oh, I think we're almost back to the first. Yeah, we are. Okay, <laughs> I've gone sort of like backwards. Let's just um, cruise across this way. But when you're flying around, of course, you kind of get lost sometimes. Wow, very nice work. Very, very nice. I, I like it. I like it. Indeed. Look at the sort of uh, boardwalk as well. It goes right around the back of that. Oh, let's, wander, let's wander on down this way. We got down through here. I think we're going backwards right now, so just cut back inside the um, clubhouse. So we'll dart on over here, down through this way. 
And now I feel like I'm sort of going the right way again. Again, another nice waterfall. Very nice, nice little green area there. We got um, we got down here. Oh, okay, this is the entrance to the course. Okay, I see it now. So that could be the clubhouse there. That building over there it could be just like a massive like holiday apartments where you could stay and play. Wow, what a a cool looking course. Is there anything down this way? I don't think we sort of wandered down here. Um, see what we got. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. I like all this planting down through the down through here. This is uh very nice. Obviously, we turn around this way. Yeah, that, that, that's a, that's a, oh, that is a nice view actually. Very nice view. The waterfalls there, all the nice planting, and you got the sort of like holiday area up in the distance, or massive big clubhouse. I'm a little unsure which it is. Wow, very nice looking course. Oh, well, there it is. Let's see if we can just sort of just pan up. We're, I think we're pretty much at the edge of the course. Just sort of pan around slowly, but there, there it is. Jericho Falls. Absolutely stunning looking little course, actually. I don't mind it. I quite like it. There is a lot of trees, which I do like, but that could um, contribute to the lag as well. The designer was having a bit of a lag issue. Now, I'm just going to quickly zoom down this way. I noticed that retaining wall, which I wanted to have a look at. And if I swing the camera around here, got another nice little waterfall right behind us. There it is there. That is very nicely done. Very nice indeed. I'm liking this. All right, let's, um, I think we should, should just zoom back over towards the, um, Massive clubhouse area, or holiday apartments, as I like to call them. Now, yeah, I reckon, I reckon we should just get straight into it. This looks really cool. Yeah, let's um, there's my little dude. Well, let's go and do it right now. Okay, hole one, par five, 573 yards, 37 feet down, eight mile winds, and I'm pretty sure I am playing on the new settings for the TGC tour. So, kind of a bit of a, a uh, warm up as well. Ooh. Not too bad. It's pretty close, man. It's pretty close, but I can see what you're going for. Not bad at all. Alright, let's point it right there. Let's go. Oh, slide a little fast. That should be on the fairway. Okay, not too bad. Now, there are, there are a few little areas that need a little bit of cleaning, but still a very nice looking course. Absolutely spectacular. The, the amount of time that it must have taken to do this course is just insane. Absolutely insane. Okay, what do we got? 249 yards, 15 feet down. Let's bring that in with... Oh. Now, I don't have a hybrid. I've got rid of my hybrid, which I'm kicking myself right now because I probably would have used it. So let's uh, see if I can do a bit of a partial three-wood into this and sort of maybe hit, hit around here and... Nice little bounce and roll up onto the, onto the green. Bring it back to about there, to be honest. Let's see what we can do with this. Oh, I absolutely crushed it. What have we got 94%. That's coming in like a duck shot in the ass too. That is off the green. A okay, nice little chip, sand wedge. Actually think that's going to be a gap wedge. Yeah, we're just a little bit taken out of it. Actually, no. I'm going full because of our lie. How thick this stuff is down here. Turn, turn, turn. Oh, wow. Didn't break. There was the break. It was clearly there. Right, anyway, that's, that's going to be a nice little birdie. Nice start to the round. Very nice start. Okay, let's keep going with that. Uh, what are we up to? Hole 2. We got hole in one chance. Nice little par 3 here. Uh, 158 yards. 44 feet up. Let's bring that in with... Let's bring it in with the 7. 
the high loft on that. Our wind is um, on it, slightly picking up. Six miles. Actually, let's bring it back out this way. Oh, a little bit of a slow. So that might work out nicely. There is a slight little hill here, which I don't think I got up. No, oh, it's coming back. It's, here it goes. Is it? Oh, yep, there it is. There it is. And there it goes. That nasty little slow swing. If I had got that um, nailed it perfect, in that. oh, he's happy. He's happy, though. I'm not as happy. No, let's keep going. Birdie putt. We got 36 feet. Don't mind the long ones. It's the short ones I've been having trouble with lately. Okay. Uh, that's... Gonna hit this. Yeah, we're gonna hit it. Let's see what happens about there. I don't think it's gonna break enough, but we'll see. Oh, that did. Oh my god! Just shaved the edge. Oh, nice little par. I'm happy with that. Definitely happy with the par. Better than a bogey. Okay, um, hole three, par four. Nice view off the tee here. We got that wind. Can I drive this? I don't like that little bit of a landing area there for me driver. It always three, would it? I think I'll drive it though. Got a little bit of wind that's going to hold me up. Let's aim for that sort of the furthest point there that we can do oh that's slow that's uh, slow that needs to sit down and stay on the fairway please oh it did too very nice and yeah, there's a lot of planting on this course it just looks very very lush I like it I like it a lot um even though I said there's probably too many trees, but I do I do like it, but yeah, maybe to help with your lag issue. Especially for consoles. Alright, what have we got? 168, 16 down. It's, oh, we do have that wind. Maybe the 7? The 7 I went into this. Oh, I've got to speed that swing up. All these little slows. Oh, nice little bounce and roll. Bounce and roll. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Too bad. 71 yards, okay. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh, what have we got here? 11 feet. These are the little parts that I don't like lately. We've been, um... Been watching our crack and cat in the raw. There will be a link in this, uh, the description below. See why I don't like the little putts. And oh my god, I've overhit it and sliced it at the same time. Oh, that's a new combination. Alright, here we go again. Come on, baby, in the hole. Okay, nice little par. Wow. I've got to stop slicing my parts, but if anyone wants to know how to um, do that, I can bring out a tutorial. It's no worries at all. Quite happy to do it. Okay, hole four, par four, 427 yards, 44 feet up. Another nice spot. This whole course is just, yeah, it looks very nice. Very nice indeed. Oh, oh. I thought I crushed it, but no, a little slow again. That's alright, that's still on the fairway. That's what I like about this. There's, there's still plenty of fairway. Unless you screw up majorly. Which is quite possible when I'm playing. Uh, what are we on? 132, 22 up. We do have a little bit of wind that's going to give us a nice little nudge. Kind of half tempted to play the pitching wedge into uh, Play the pitching wedge into this. Yeah, I think we'll... I think we'll Go with it. Do that wind. Bring it back over here. There we go. There's a perfect. 
bounce and roll. <gasps> oh, go. Go on. Oh, you're kidding me. This ball is just going to tease me all day. You can see it now. Another little birdie. Stamp it down. Okay, two under after four, I think, are we? Yes, we are. All right, hole five, par four. Just keep it, keep our old hips old limbered up. And let's go. What have we got? 368 yards, 44 feet down. Can I drive that? That is the question. But it's 44 feet down to the pin. Oh, you know what? I reckon. There's a good chance we could drive that. I'm going to go for it. Why not? Let's see what we can do. Oh, slight little slow. Get up. Oh, we're on. We are on. Here it is. Okay, 75 yards. Nice little gap wedge pitch. Um... Actually, I'm going to take this gap wedge pitch. I'm just out over here, just in case I ever shoot this. Probably fall short now on me. Oh no. It's not too bad. That worked out beautifully. In fact. This little birdie part here. Besides that break. Okay, not a bad round at all. This is this is a nice course. It really is. Really nice course. I um I came across this on Facebook actually. I was uh, flicking through one on um, one lunchtime at work there and yeah, found it on the um designers in the designers group. I had a lot of um a lot of good courses over there. Tell you what. Alright, what do we got here? Hole in one. Here we go. 33 feet down at 199 yards. 10 mile winds. Um, play the four. Maybe catch that back edge, get a bit of a rollback. That's what I'm kind of hoping here. Some high loft on this. Oh, fast. That wind is not going to bring it around as much as I thought. And it's not going to get up on the hill like I thought either. Slightly. Yes, very slightly. What's it doing? Oh, wow. Okay. A birdie part. What do we got? What are we looking at? 22 feet. And that's got some turn to it. I want to overhit this because that could easily roll off by the look of the green. Let's give it a nice little tap. So let's bring it out just a little bit more. Feels, feels alright. <laughs> just on the inside, just missed it. Could have done with just that whisk a little more. Out to the left. But not bad. Okay, three under. Let's go. What do we got here? Hole seven. A four. Three hundred and ninety-four yards. Have the three wood in the hand. I'm gonna rip out the driver for this. To make a nice bounce down that hill. That's if I get up that high. Feeling that wind's gonna hold me a bit. Let's play actually higher. Oh, there it is. That was crisp. I love that sound. Well, there it is. Going to get that nice roll and round the corner a bit. Should leave us a nice shot into the green here. Nice little backdrop too. Very nicely done. Okay, 117 yards, 31 feet down. Let's take some out of this. This little roll coming in. We do have that bit of wind. It's paying about a hundred. I might I think I might take the lob wedge here. Well, yeah, looking at the lie, looking at the wind. 
Everything's sort of lining up right now. Oh, that needs to get up a boogie. That needs to start rolling down. Oh, that stopped dead. Well, that was um, that was a bit of a miscalculation by me. Okay, anyway, 38 feet. Let's see if we can sink it. It's downhill too. I'm trying to take a little bit out of it. Got that bit more. Oh, is it coming around? <gasps> that is in. Water part. There it is. Or under. Oh yeah, that was a that was a huge part. Oh, I was thinking, do we give him the replay or not? Just decided to give him the replay. That was not a bad part, actually. I had my doubts at first. I was like, oh, it's not going. But then, at the end there, it turned. Tell you what, I'm glad, I, I'm glad that did go in. Because that would have rolled. If I had missed that hole, that would have kept rolling. Okay, hole 8, par 5. That That is a beautiful shot off that tee. That's... Possibly a thumbnail, something like that. We'll see. I'll come back and do that. Um, alright. I feel I think we can nail this. Let's see if we, that wind will take me up there. Oh my fucking god! Where the hell did that red slow come from? Oh, there's no way. There is a tree right in front of me. There is. Three would it? Let's do it. See if we can smash through everything. Oh, we're out. Oh, that's a bonus. I was scared I was going to hit a tree trunk there somewhere. Somewhere in there. That was thick, I tell you. Um, alright. We got 112. We could still still make birdie here. Um, 28. Up. Got a bit of wind. Eight. No, we'll take a normal into this, please. 112, 28 up. Let's add. So wind actually, that might not be too bad. Let's see how this goes. Oh, get where's normal now. Come on, baby, sit down, sit down, sit down. <gasps> Drop it all. Oh, that was close. Nice little. There it is. Still made birdie. Don't know how I did. Um, okay, hole nine. A four. 342 yards, 24 feet down. We are driving this. Hell yeah, we are. All the way. Hopefully I don't get a slow. Oh, I did. I got the slight slow. I'm going to have to speed my swing up with this driver. Not as forgiving as the old um, Taylor made. Goes further. Yeah, not as forgiving. A sandwich chip. Gap wedge? Or maybe? Not that percentage though. It could be a pitching wedge, but I don't want it to roll too far. I'll take the gap wedge. Need this to get. Out of the rough, though. I did too. Yep. Stop, ball, stop. Well, that was a different camera angle, wasn't it? I oh, don't be disheartened, mate. It's all good. Oh, she's frozen. Something, something's going on. Nope, there it is. Well, that was lucky. I was going to say it's the first time ever that I've had sort of like an issue with the game like that, but just needed a little, um, Jump start, I think. Okay, not bad. Six under on the front nine. Not too bad. Let's sit out of the back and see what this has got. Um, hole 10, par 4. Nice little rock edge there. Not mind this at all, I tell you what. Very nice course. Oh, wow, there's a red slow again. It's alright, the green's still reachable. 
Number 153, 27 up. See? Even on the pro settings, it's possible to get a red slow. Uh, 27 up. That's once. It's that wind. What? Oh, plus my. Okay, hang on, let's just um, calculate the rough first. So about a 5. Plus the wind, maybe a 4. See what happens. A lot of wind. Oh, that's not getting up there. Oh, shit. Alright, playing for par now. Unless I get this in the hole. A lot with splash. Let's take... Sandwich splash. This... Okay, playing for the par. Oh, little ass puck and putt too. It's in. Okay. Oh, that was a rough trot, that one. Yep, club straight. Let's use it. Alright, what do we got? Hole 11, par 4. Uh, 347 yards, 39 down. 3 iron. Yep, that's definitely... Iron, or can we drive there? No, let's um, let's just three iron it. Oh, now I got now I've gone the other direction and ripped a massive fast into it. That was almost a red fast too. All right, crack. Stop thinking about the swing tempo and just hit the ball, and we'll be fine. All right, one twenty-three, twenty-three. A little bit of wind. 118 with the gap wedge. Yeah, I reckon that. That's. Let's go. What oh, was the green? Were, they, were the green soft? Medium. So they feel soft. Seem soft. Yeah, let's um that a little tap there. Oh, there was no way that was coming back. That was way too far out. Jackass. Oh, this could end badly. This could end real badly. Oh my god, that scrapes in. Thought I overhit it then. Alright, back nine, eh? Back nine. <laughs> Let's go. Um, Alright, hole 12, par 4. Uh, what do we got? 439. Oh, this is that um split fairway. Okay, ah, oh, so we play from over here, right. There's trees to contend with. I wonder if we can just hop over the top of those. Easy. That's it. Just hold the fairway, baby, and we'll be all good. A 318 out of that. Not too bad. Oh, what do we got here? 127. That's, um... 27 with a nice view of the uh, waterfall. A nice job on that. Um... 7... A little bit of wind. Punch it a bit through the wind. Oh, wow. I ripped into that. Oh, that, don't, that was almost in the bunker, too. A little lob wedge chip. Oh, that's... That's, um... That's gonna run, so let's... Bring that back. Okay, not too bad. Oh, now, 
Is this for par? I'm, I'm hoping it is right now. There it is, okay. Nice little break at the back of the foot there. And it played that straight. Cool. Okay, not too bad. So, um, yeah, I don't know if, um, a lot of people have been watching old Cracking Cat in the Raw. I'm, I'll tell you what, me and Mike, we really enjoy doing that. So, yeah, if you do enjoy it, um, by all means, yeah, chuck a comment and let us know. Might even, um, I don't know, throw out a course to people that comment all the time and, um, I maybe let them pick the course every now and then. Yeah, I, d I just hate to, um, uh, leave anyone out if too many courses get thrown out. So we'll, we'll see what happens in the future. But yeah, no, I really enjoy playing that. There's a lot of um, trash talk going on. And yeah, can't wait for the next episode. Ooh, it was a doozy, I tell ya. Um, all right, 100 and, uh, sorry, 218 yards. What have we got? 46 down. Eight feet. Eight miles, sorry, going with us. And my mind has just turned to shit right now. <laughs> uh, 40, it's about 200, 300. Plus, uh, we, let's bring that back. Let's go of the full. Oh, finally a perfect. Oh, that's coming in hot. That is coming in hot. See, so yeah, I'll um, I'll chuck a link in the description below too to um, one of the old cracking cat in the raw um episodes. You might enjoy it. It's only the front nine, or the back nine, depending on... We usually play, like, one course, one full course, but we'll do... We'll break it up. We'll do the front nine, then the back nine, and we, we keep a tally of the scores. Because, um, yeah, we're... we're <laughs> no matter how fun it is playing with, uh, like, against each other, we're always out to kick each other's ass. No matter what it is. Yeah, very competitive, but fun. Let's put it there. It's downhill. Let's take a little bit out. I don't think that is going to turn. Oh my, oh my god. I thought that was going to go. I thought it was just going to poke its head in the side door. Alright, we're just sort of flatlining on the back nine. My mojo's gone and I don't know, but I think my clubs are a little bent too. Something's bent. Alright, hole 14. Um, hole, hole in one chance. This little par three here. Eight miles coming at us. 33 feet up. Man, that's... Okay, we're going to we're gonna have to rocket it with the three iron. This could fall short. I'm hoping it doesn't. I'm hoping the wind doesn't hold it up too much. Oh, that wind is holding it. That is holding it. And... Bunker. Access denied. Um, splash just, just increase it a little bit now for that little bit of a lie oh wow the backspin that that ball had on it then okay part time again <laughs> Let's see if, see if I can make something out of this hole. At least. 15th. Alright, par 4. Let's go. Oh, we got the wind going with us, so we can we can launch this. Let's put it right there, actually. Slight little fast. Oh, get up, baby. Get up. Off the rock. Oh, no, we're on. We're on. It's alright. Stop panicking. My God, I thought it was going to come short, though. All right, uh, 131, again with the wind. Let's go to the gap wedge. I'll take the, let's, actually, let's go to the pitching wedge. Some high loft on it. See what that does. Where's the pit? Oh, this might be good. Get in the hole. Oh, there it is. Again, another nice shot. Oh, I just scraped it in. Only just. 
Oh, that's a that is a birdie on the back nine. My God, look out! That's right, shaping up for this 16th hole. What do we got? Par four, 373 yards. Yes, please. Let's go for it. Oh, this drive is a little harder to nail that um, perfect, isn't it? It's alright. That'll leave us a nice little bob wedge pitch in. That's going to run downhill. Let's see if we can drop this short. We're there. Oh, that was... <laughs> there was nothing short about that. Wow. Hey. It's chip. Take this. Oh, nasty. I thought it was going to break. I thought I had that, actually. Another little par. Well, so what are we on at the moment? Uh, seven under. That's not too bad. Two holes remaining. Kind of flat lined at this um on this back nine, but we got a nice big par five here with a gorgeous little view across this lake or big ass pond, whatever you like to call it. It bounces off the rock. No, I won't do that. Let's just put it straight up there. Oh, there it is. Crisp. Okay, what do we got? Three iron, maybe? Don't think I'll be using a three wood. Three iron. Okay, that's... Okay. Let's see, if we, let's see what we can do here. onto the green for me. Roll up, baby. Oh, it's on. There it is. This could be for an eagle here. Okay, what have we got? 13 feet. Uh, time. A little bit of a break. God, just shaved the edge. Oh, par. I mean, birdie. Sorry. So used to getting pars. <laughs> oh damn, bugger! I missed that eagle. Okay, hole eighteen. Lucky last. Oh, another par five. Back to back. It's giving me another opportunity to um get double digits here. One foot down. Oh, this is. 580 yards. This is um, this is gonna be different. Oh no! Don't you dare! It stayed on, but it's put us in a thick shit. Right, so eight iron, three iron, three wood. Nah, nah, we're gonna have to play short. Let's play, let's play the seven. That's a, that's a bugger too. I only had to nail that fairway. It's been interesting, that hole. Oh, I've gone from one rough to the other. Come on, get out. Get out. Get out. Oh no, still the light rough. Okay, what do we got? 133 remaining. On this last hole. 133. Oh, the lie is not too bad in the rough, actually. It is lie rough, okay. I thought we were in the thick of the, um, yeah, heavy rough, to be honest. 18 up. Take the 9. Well, that's coming in hot. That is coming in hot. Pull out the nets. We need to slow that thing down. Oh, and I've left my...
myself a big putt. Um, all right, what do we got here? Ooh, 41 feet, two inches up. Okay, so that's going to break a little that way and then a little bit that way. This almost seems like a straight putt. Let's just pull it slightly left of center. That last little bit, I think it's going to break a bit there. Push it out. Now come back. Oh, come back, come back, come back. Oh, my God. Hey, that didn't break as hard as I thought. Oh, it was slightly downhill. I didn't even notice that. That'll teach me for not having a proper look. Oh, well, there it is. What do we get out of that? Pa. Okay, eight under for the round. Not too bad. That was a... That was a nice course. I really enjoyed that. Thoroughly enjoyed that course. So again, there it is. Jericho Falls Golf Club. And that was designed by Fringe Element. A.K.A. Jake Perry. Well done, dude. That was, that was a nice course, man. Very nice course. Good to see you back in the designer too, eh? <laughs> all right, well, that is me done, people. By all means, if you do like this and would like to support the channel, yeah, smash that thumbs up. Smash that subscribe and... Yeah, I'll catch you next time. Alright, later.